Welcome to our Cinumeric video tutorial. In this video, we will show how to use arithmetic variable or R variable programming in Siemens CNC controllers, which is applicable for Cinumeric 802D, 810D, 840D, 808D and 828D controllers. By adopting this programming method, you can achieve flexible programming with minimal inputs, shorten the programming blocks, develop customized programming easily. Complex workpieces can be handled even by unskilled operators. Modify the program with minimal inputs via screen or variables. Use maximum of 300 R variables for programming which can be extended further to 1000 variables in premium controllers. With so many benefits, one would like to know how to see the R variables in the controller. It's very simple. Select Offset followed by User Variables Horizontal Soft Key and select R Variable from Vertical Soft Key. Before we start with variable programming, we must understand the comparators or comparison operands which are used to compare the values of two variables with if or for or while loop. The double equal symbol means enable condition or task when variable value is same during comparison. Less than and greater than means values are not equal. Similarly, greater than, less than, greater than or equal to, less than or equal to and single equal means assign the value to any variable, like R1 is equal to 4. Let us take an example for profile mill, which needs to be machined to a depth of 5 mm and every time a depth of 1 mm cut needs to be machined. To mill this profile, let's consider 20 mm diameter end mill and take work 0 to the extreme left corner. Here we use R1 variable to define the incremental depth of cut for z-axis. So mention R1 is equal to 1 in the N1 block. Later, we define the tool followed by spindle speed. In the next line, define the approach point in XY positions. Block number N9 is used to loop the program every time with the IF condition. In the N10 block, we are going to bring the z-axis down where we will translate the value of R1 to z-axis. Continue to write program with compensation as per profile till N21. In N22 block, we increase the depth of cut by 1 mm, commended as R1 is equal to R1 plus 1. Since the previous value of R1 was 1 mm, we now increase it 1 which means present value of R1 becomes 2 mm. In N23 block, compare the value of R1 using if condition. The syntax will be if R1 less than equal to 5, go to B N9. The present value of R1 that is 2 mm now will now compare the value of R1 with 5 mm which is lesser than 5 mm resulting in the program to restart from block number N9 for second depth. This process will continue till R1 reaches 5 mm and machining happens in parallel. After 5 passes, R1 will become 5 mm. Now the if condition fails and as a result comes out of the loop and continues the program from N24 to M30. Let us connect to a CNC machine for a live demo. Go to Program Manager to open the program created as per earlier instructions. We can now see the program block as explained. Verify the program in offline simulation by selecting Simulation from horizontal soft keys. Execute the program and press Cycle Start. As the program is running, Visualize the 2D simulation. To verify depth, 3D simulation is a better option. Here we can see the number of passes and the depth of the cut as well. Using R variable, programming can be done easily with Cinumeric CNC. 
To know more about Sanumeric Solutions, log in to www.siemens.co.in/dex.